All right, uh, I'm just going to go over these couple of rhythms because you have the recording. Um, so again, that very first rhythm, eighth quarter, eighth. So we're going to change our concept of that as eighth, eighth, eighth rest, eighth. And it goes on our timeline. So, move, dot, rest. Right? As long as you think about it like that, it's fine. Then you have your triplet. Triplet's really important because it has that note in the space. Right? Just have that concept. Um, and then we did on the second line, um, that little, the triplet starts on four. It's a triplet. First beat of the triplet is a rest and then the notes. So we go rest, da, da, da. Rest. Rest. Like that. And then the hard part. Uh, let's go to the that's the fourth line with the sixteenth note triplet and the eighth note. Um, again, that eighth note is going to be on your and over here. So we're going to go uh, da da da, and we go da 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 ba, da 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 ba. Like how fast these go doesn't really matter as long as you nail that other one. So you could go. If you forget the trill, it's just an ornament. If you forget that and just play the important note, which is A. It's a good way to practice that. Next line, uh, we have this group, the 16th notes, first 16th rest. Uh, so I go one, two, three. again, same kind of thing. The the B two there is a rest, and then the and is just going to be that um, the and of your left hand. Mm -hmm. Again, we're interpreting <laughs> all this. The and of your left hand is that C. So if I go uh, da, 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 da. same as this little. Doesn't matter how fast that is, as long as you can stick the, stick the landing. The C goes with the and. Uh, hopefully that's not too confusing. The next line, there's 16th notes. For the purposes of this, let's do the same thing. We'll treat that exactly the same as the uh, 16th note triplet with an eighth note. So B, the D flat on beat one is gonna be here, and then that A at the end is gonna be your and. So you're gonna go, oops, okay, or, those three notes uh -huh. and then landing that A and then immediately followed by a triplet which is a really hard rhythm it's such an awesome rhythm oh, yeah. right so good shed that one that's a, it's a really important thing most people can't do that but if you take the time to take it apart you'll get it and it's really good rhythm and it's really important rhythm and it's a hip rhythm people will look at you like oh my god you're from Ukraine? <laughs> uh, and then that last one. Uh, what is that? Uh, <laughs> that's a good one. Uh, just to get into it, again, this is slow, so you can take your time with it. Uh, that next measure, it's on beat four. And of course, it's a tie from the previous uh, beat. Uh, but this one we are going to interpret it as uh, the 16th notes start on the and. So there's two in the and. So what that means is duh, if you go one and two and one. Yeah, yeah. So it's not that crazy. One, uh, if you go four and. Okay, so that whole measure. to get over so if we take out the ornament mm -hmm. right it's not that crazy yeah. I'm gonna... <laughs> 
<laughs> All right? Mm -hmm. And then... <laughs> that's the same thing on those 16th notes. The next 16th notes are on the and as well. Mm -hmm. So... And those ones, the last two, the D flat and the B flat, just, just flick them. Okay. Don't, don't worry about it. Does the same, you know. It's weird, but you can do it. So. I'll just do it 15 times faster. <laughs>